Tell me about a show that changed your life. One that came to mind was a police synchronicity tour in 1983 and just the hype on the front end, getting ready for the show, um, learning the lyrics, studying the album, listening to the music all the way down. Um, and then when Sting and Band came out on stage, it was pretty, pretty terrific. Can you tell me about an artist to watch breaking into the next year? Who are you kind of into right now? There are so many great artists breaking into the new year. And some of my favorites with a little bit of a Nashville slant include Gone West, um, Molly Tuttle, Tennille Arts, and Runaway June. Was there a live show that you saw? Was there a favorite live show, favorite performance? Prior to the pandemic and shortly before the pandemic shut um, the world down, our person of the year was hosted in um, January and we honored Aerosmith. And there were so many amazing performances that night. Her, John Legend, um, Melissa Etheridge, Alice Cooper. I mean, it was just an extraordinary evening of amazing, amazing music. What is the best or worst career-related advice you've received? The worst career-related advice that I ever received. At one point, somebody said to me, don't waste your time helping others, just focus on yourself. And if I had done that, I wouldn't have had the career that I've had. <laughs>